Paul, as you said, this really is just the warm up for what is to come tomorrow. Behind me, those traffic cones mark the spot where that truck crashed earlier tonight and knocked out the traffic signal. Central Marin police say the wet conditions contributed to this accident. Tonight, a nasty crash on a slick road in Larkspur. A truck carrying lumber smashed into a traffic light pole on Sir Francis Drake Boulevard at the Golden Gate Ferry Terminal. Fire crews had to rescue two people trapped in the cab. Two others were able to get out on their own. On several streets throughout Marin County, we saw a taste of what's to come tomorrow. A monster rainstorm that promises to hit the North Bay especially hard. On 101, it was slow going in Corte Madera, and at times it fell steadily in downtown San Anselmo. This is the first time hearing of it, so that's kind of good that you guys are getting that out there. But um, I mean, we have like candles and stuff and like flashlights, so in case the lights go out, we have that prepared. Public works crews in San Rafael are expecting to answer nonstop maintenance calls like this one for the next 48 hours or so. They cleared storm drains blocked by debris, hoping to prevent major flooding tomorrow. We're seeing a higher volume of calls than we normally do. However, it's not as crazy as we are expecting tomorrow when the atmospheric river comes in. The CHP is reminding drivers to leave early and take it slow. Eliza Skaggs commutes to San Francisco for work. I take the bus, and so that's actually a nice way to um, get into the city. I don't have to worry. The Marin County Public Works Department says that it will have crews at the ready to respond to flooding calls all day tomorrow. And that flash flood watch for Marin County is in effect from 3 p.m. Wednesday through 3 a.m. on Thursday. Live in Larkspur, Betty Yu, KPIX 5.